everyone welcome back to my channel so this tutorial today is one of the most requested looks that I posted on Instagram and on Facebook this look is a very easy or it's a very simple neutral fall look that I know you guys will love it does look good on pictures like on my outfit post all right so I already did my foundation now I'm just gonna do my eyebrows and my eye makeup so for you to achieve a nice and thick eyebrows, you have to fill them in first with an eyebrow pencil. Here, I'm using an, an eyebrow pencil that is close to my hair color. Use a spoolie to properly distribute the product into your eyebrows. Also use an eyebrow powder to set the pencil, so that it would stay on longer all throughout the day. First eyeshadow I'll be using is this taupe color from my Coastal Sense Quad Palette. Using a fluffy blending brush, use it to distribute the eyeshadow on the crease area. Take a dark brown eyeshadow and apply it on the outer part of the crease. Next, just apply a very light matte pink eyeshadow right in the center of your eyelids. Using your favorite liner, create a winged liner. Make sure you go thinner towards the inner area. Highlight the brow bone using the same light pink eyeshadow that we used earlier. Oh, and put on your false eyelashes too. And using the same dark brown eyeshadow, apply it on the lower lash line. This technique will make your eyes appear larger if you have small eyes like me. I like to apply brown eye pencil as well to make the color more intense. You can use black if you want. Now to make the eyes even bigger, use a white or light pink eye pencil. If you have short lashes, tight lining is one of the ways to make them appear longer. One of my fave techniques lately is applying brown liner in the tear ducts. I just feel like it enhances the shape of my eye a little bit more. Don't forget to apply mascara on your upper and lower lashes. I'm using my Benefit Their Real Mascara to make sure I get the maximum length that I want. Now I just reapply my contour and add blush to my cheeks. I'm using a matte pink blush here to give a sweet flush to this look. For the lips, I like to line my lips first so that whatever I put will not bleed. Here I'm using one from my Jcat lip liners, one of my fave brands when it comes to lip liners. For the main color, I'm using my LA Splash liquid lipstick in the color Untamed. It's a gorgeous matte plum that is super perfect for this season. Plus, it stays all throughout the day so you don't have to worry about reapplying. And that's basically it, a fab look for fall that will surely make you look your best. Thank you for watching and see you in my next video. Bye! Mwah.